Hello and welcome to our channel. So as you can see that the, we have uh, some participant records here and I'm going to show you how can we bulk update these participant record uh, according to marks obtained by them in a trial. So first of all, we need to update those records. We would select uh, export to Excel, open in an Excel workbook and uh, let's suppose we will give it 64 marks to him and uh, then we will just fill the cell so as we can see that uh, these uh, these guys are having these marks and my in this video i'm going to show you the plugin and that plugin there is a logic that if a participant is getting marks less than 70 then he will be not selected so click on save then so we will uh, wait to import these records or we could also track it So now as you can see that's passing. So as you can see that uh, we have imported all record and as soon as I'm going to refresh it you will see that this trial result these are the options that uh, they, some of them will be get selected just like I've opened it. Now as you can see it's so our plugin has done and the person who is getting those marks they are uh, the trial results also selecting and not selected or selected. So I'm going to show you that how can we achieve it by a plugin which would it bulk update the records. So for that first of all we need to open our Visual Studio in code. So first of all I have make sure that uh, this plugin will run on update uh, message and this is calling the services I plugin services integer value. This is the option set value I'm uh, connect, converting into integer values. Uh, these are the options just like selected for not selected. And this is the page size, uh, so you could uh, make it as a page size because sometimes you have time we have to update uh, records in bulk and there may be thousands in uh, them. So that's why we need to use this. Uh, you could ignore it also because uh, right now for this trial I didn't have that much of sample data. And if you have some sample data and then you can make sure that uh, all the plugin will execute uh, for all the records that you have. And then I have written down the query expression that this is my participant entity's logical name and this is the marks obtained logical name and new call set I'm taking here page size I'm, con uh, I'm just having here the criteria filter expression that uh, marks obtained should not be null and then entity collection that all the records that we have so that will retrieve multiple we will retrieve all the records that a participant uh, entity has and uh, now if the participant entity count is more than zero then we will execute multiple request bulk update request for new multiple request and here also we are going to go for for each we will check that uh, marks uh, get we will get the value of the marks table uh, marks obtained table and then we are checking that if the marks is greater than or equal to 70 then it's selected op uh, selected option and if uh, it's not then not select and then we are updating our identity with the participants ids that we have that trial result will get the option set value trial result value from here so if it's getting less than 17, then it will not select it. And then if it is a uh, participant getting more than 17, then it will uh, select as selected. Code, you can see it. And then I say sign the code as this ubts.snk. And after that, I've, I have built it here. And then I'm going to register it. So this is my assembly and uh, then I have added the step which is on update. So this is the message is, uh, message is update, primary entity is participant, filtering attribute I have selected the marks obtained. Uh, this plugin code will be executed in post operation and execution mode is asynchronous and now we can create a step or uh, just update this step. Now we will go to our uh, CRM and we will create a trial. So let's create a trial on uh, Olympic swimming. Game would be swimming. City, I would select Delhi. Click on save. So all the students who are lives in Delhi and they are interested game in swimming will be added here. Only two students who are interested in swimming, uh, and then they are from Delhi. So what we can do, we could do just from here. Uh, let's suppose he is getting marks like uh, 85 then save and close and uh, then Kaushik is getting marks 57 and save and close so we have uploaded the marks and the test result will be 
updated according to marks so we will refresh it and now you can see that trash results has selected and not selected according to their marks obtained so that's it from our video